Hi, I'm Izzy, and this is Dizzy Quilts and Sews. Welcome to episode 36 of Hashtag Friday Sews. So first, a very, very happy Thanksgiving to all of my American friends and subscribers and viewers. I hope uh, you had a wonderful holiday with family yesterday. And in the spirit of Thanksgiving, a huge thank you to Jen from Today in Jen's Sewing Room, who created this Friday Sews hashtag. I am so grateful to her and to the hashtag because thanks to the hashtag, I've met so many wonderful, generous, inspiring sewing vloggers and um, all of you who watch my videos and who comment and who just say such nice things. Um, I've, I've, I feel very, very blessed and spoiled by what this hashtag has brought into my life. So huge thank you to you, Jen. All right, so this hashtag is all about chatting about what's been going on in our sewing room over the last week and what we've got planned, as well as a little bit about life. So in my sewing room this week, there's been a little bit going on. So the first thing I finished and published was my tutorial for the A Gift to November uh, vlog tour. So basically my tutorial shows you how to make this little mug rug, which I love. I'm so happy with it. And it was um, published on the channel on Monday, the 21st of November. So if you haven't looked at it yet, you can definitely do so. I'll put a link to it in the description box below. As you can see, Bear decided to join in on the fun. So I don't know how long I'm going to have of quiet before. There we go. Okay. You all good there, baby? Yes. All right. So the second thing that's happened in the sewing room this week is I made great progress on my octave coat with the wool I bought from Core Fabrics a while ago. So my outer coat is all put together. So I've got the sleeves on. I've got the hood on. Um, I've got the pockets. I mean, this is so nice. It's got the princess seams. Not that you can really tell in this fabric, but oh my goodness, this is going to be awesome. Awesome. So now I have to sew together the lining and then attach the lining to the coat, make one buttonhole, sew on a button and then make the belt and this is going to be done. So crossing my fingers, I'm going to be able to get it done before the end of the month because this was on my November plans list. So I'm still hoping I can get it done. Um, I've not, I've been taking my time and I've not run into any issues at all with this pattern or with the fabric. So but yeah, I am going very, very slow. So hoping I can have it done by the end of the month. In terms of plans, well, I want to finish my coat and I really want to get a few more gifts sewn up um, by the end of next week. So I placed an order to get supplies for one of the gifts and Everything else I have, really, I just have to get going. I've just not been willing to put aside the coat to work on gifts. But, uh, yeah, as soon as this coat is done, it'll be gift sewing for the next little while. The good news is all of my shopping is already done. Yay! So no more Christmas shopping for me. I'm done. First time in history that I'm done before December 1st. So I'm really, really, really pleased. And that's a lot of stress and a lot right off my plate. So that's amazing. Now about shopping. Um, 
a few good Black Friday deals this week that I took advantage of. Um, not that much, though. I've been trying to stay away from the Black Friday sale emails. Um, yeah, so I ordered, like I said, I ordered some supplies for some gifts I want to make. I bought three patterns from Cashmirette. Uh, they're having a 25% off site-wide, and there were a few patterns I really wanted from them. So I bought the Vernon shirt. I bought the, hold on, got to go look at my notes apparently. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. The Lennox shirt dress and the Tobin sweater. Now the Tobin, I had my eye on that one for probably at least a year now. So I finally pulled the trigger with 25% off, I figured. And yeah, the Lennox shirt dress is just so beautiful. And the Vernon shirt, I have the Harrison shirt from Cashmerette, but the Vernon is a darted bodice instead of princess seams. And it's got a more relaxed kind of fit and look to it. So I figured if I find some really nice flannel, I think that would make a really cool kind of like over shirt. So I did that. Then I got an email that Blackbird Fabrics was having a sale, also 25% off. And I bought a couple of things, not very much. I didn't go crazy. I just bought a couple of cuts of fabric for me. I want to make myself a new lounge set. So I bought some sweatshirting type fabric. So, but not, not, uh, I didn't go crazy. And that's pretty much it. That's all the shopping I've done. And I am not planning any more shopping. I don't need anything else. Um, all, like I said, all my Christmas shopping is done. So, um, yeah, that'll, that's it, really. In terms of life, well, um, work has been quiet this week because half my team is in the U.S., so they've all been off. The entire U.S. business has been off um, for two days. So it's been very, very quiet and I've been able to catch up on things, which is amazing. And this coming weekend, um, our granddaughter, our oldest granddaughter is coming to spend the weekend. So I can't wait. It'll be nice to have to have her over for a couple of days and get some stuff done with her. Haven't decided yet what we're going to do. It's going to depend on the weather because it's supposed to be very nice this weekend with temperatures above zero. Um, so we might go outside. We might go and visit um, her cousins. So yeah, playing it by ear, but I'm afraid not a whole lot of sewing is going to happen until Sunday so it's but it's going to be nice I haven't seen her in a while so it'll be really nice to hang out with my little pumpkin pie and that's going to do it for me this week um, I hope you've had a wonderful week I hope you have a great great weekend let me know in the comments if you've done any shopping for Black Friday or if there are some incredible deals out there I would love to know Please leave the video a like on your way out if you liked it and consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks again for stopping by and I will see you soon.